Multiple women have now came forward citing similar stories of sexual harassment, and earlier this month, Rose McGowan, one of the women who reached a financial settlement with Weinstein, called for the men of Hollywood to speak up. McGowan accused Damon of staying silent after the story broke. In a tweet posted the 9th of October, she wrote, Hey at Matt Damon, what's it like to be a spineless profiteer who stays silent alongside a message naming the board members of Weinstein's company she believed should resign? She then tweeted Ben Affleck, Casey Affleck, how's your morning boys? Shortly after, McGowan retweeted a tweet from another account that linked to a Vulture.com article about Damon and actor Russell Crowe being accused of helping to kill a Weinstein story. Read more Kate Winslet defied bosses when she left Weinstein out of Oscar speech but both Clooney and Damon insist they were unaware of the full extent of Weinstein's behavior towards women. Clooney said the producer bragged about affairs with various actresses but he never believed him I didn't really think that they were going to have affairs with Harvey, quite honestly. And clearly they didn't. Affleck also took to Facebook last week to address Paltrow's story. Affleck, who worked with Weinstein on several films, including Goodwill Hunting, Reindeer Games and Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back, wrote this is completely unacceptable, and I find myself asking what I can do to make sure this doesn't happen to others. However, McGowan alleged that Affleck had been aware of how Weinstein treated women, and said she once had a conversation with him about it. You lie, she wrote. McGowan was then suspended from Twitter for telling Affleck to FK off. McGowan has been one of the most prominent figures to speak out against Weinstein, who has now been publicly accused of sexual harassment and or assault by numerous women, including Gwyneth Paltrow, Angelina Jolie, Cara Delevingne, Romola Garay, Ellie Acute Acidu and Asia Argento. Many of the women disclosed these revelations to reporters from The New Yorker and The New York Times, prompting others to come forward. In response to the NYT article, Weinstein issued a statement, saying I appreciate the way I've behaved with colleagues in the past has caused a lot of pain, and I sincerely apologize for it. Though I'm trying to do better, I know I have a long way to go. However, he has denied reports of non-consensual sex. Images Rex features.